I'm sure you've experienced having your phone in your pocket while doing something active, so cycling or running or whatever, and your phone feels like it's about to fall out, and sometimes it does actually fall out. And so I thought of a solution for that, and this channel's not really meant to be a life hack channel or anything, so I, I just, but I just kind of thought it was quite cool. So here is the life hack. Okay, so what you have to do is, so if you can flip one of your trousers inside out, and then this one I've already done it with, but essentially what you do is you cut a hole so where the corner of your phone would go. So my phone goes in the pocket like that. And then the, so sorry, I don't know if you can see that. So my phone goes in the corner like that. And then it goes in the pocket, goes in the cut that I made, just like that. Okay. So if I was to put it in normally, so if I was to put it in through this way, what would happen? So, it says normal, and then my phone just has to get tucked in to that corner, right? And then I wear it as normal. There's no issues, right? I, I'm happy to shake it around as much as I want, right? Because I know it's, no, I know it's never going to fall out, right? I just know it went. And so, it's pretty cool. To be fair, it's a new phone, so I should, probably shouldn't risk that. But it hasn't fallen out yet, so I don't think it will anytime soon. So, I thought I'd show you guys how to actually do it. So here I've got one of my shorts. And just put your phone in the pocket of the required trousers slash shorts in this case. And then flip the shorts inside out. Okay. Super simple. Just flip it inside out. Okay. So, once inside out, find the pocket with the phone in. Take your phone. Scroll like this. Move it all the way. To the very corner yeah and then mark a line so just get a pen sorry you do need a pen and then so for example this one this is the first pen I found and just mark a line across your phone so like that say so if you want a really really bigger line just... so take your phone out and then And then you can just go like this. And then finish it off. If you made a mistake, just don't worry. Get a what do you call this? Get some string and a needle, a sewing needle, and sew them back together. And also, if you're worried about the cut opening, about it ripping further and further, just get a needle as well, like I said. And so, so for example. One problem that might happen, this, this works fine, right, normally, with my phone. But if I wanted to try and hold my mum's phone in my phone pocket, or my dad's phone in my pocket, then it would fall out, like, normal. So, for example, I'll show you. I've got my mum's phone, I'll just put it in the pocket. And then, watch. It doesn't fit, it's a lot, it's way too big to fit in the hole. Or otherwise, it may be too small. So basically, the cuts that you make, they're specialised for your own specific phone. And you can't really use it for someone else's phone. That's the only real downside. So if you enjoyed this, share this with any of your friends that you feel might find this useful. And if you enjoyed, don't forget to like and subscribe if you want to see more content like this. Um, If you've watched until this far, if you watch this far and all the way until the end, then I thought I might tell you. The reason there's this on my shirt is because I've connected my headphone mic. It's connected wired to my phone and I've attached it onto a paper clip. And that's kind of why there's this weird thing sticking here. And if it's improved the audio quality, do tell me. I would like some criticism because that would be helpful. Because I have no idea what I'm doing right now. I'm just kind of, you know, your feedback would be appreciated, I guess. So if this looks visually unappealing, yeah, just say so. If you find the audio is better, just say so. If you find the audio is worse, say so. I've only got your guys' criticism to go off. So thanks for watching, and if you enjoyed, don't forget to 